half a day peeps um, I just wanted to show I, I, I did a little vintage shopping today for uh, um, a hot hand carved solid wood table dining table with uh, six chairs um, four dining chairs and, um, and two armchairs isn't that a great find it's a vintage find just like that that china cabinet there but look at this the arms and it's all solid it's heavy and it came with a glass table as well i got it off of one of my peeps thank you so much peeps i love it um i'll probably do a little work on it but not much really it's gorgeous and then so far this place is still i'm st still a lot to do right now because uh, i don't know what i'm going to do with this ifa wood table that goes with that the chairs go with this table over here this is another find that i picked up vintage look at that and solid wood also and that goes well with that the legs are curved the same and then this is teak so this is all and that's from bali the, yeah bali when i went and got that there and then this one also which this is the piece the this couch if you can see from behind see i'm i'm still working on uh my stuff there's my ties and my belts so i'm still work this room this area is still in progress so this is the the furniture that i said i needed to get um reupholstered uh, so I'm going to do that. I'm going to have it the same fabric or whatever. I decide to use leather or whatever also for that. So that way they can match. So, so far, um, of course, the window treatments are going to change. This couch has to go into the other house because I need to find another hand carved wood. I'm trying to change all this to all hardwood type of furnishings in here. Because I'm also doing a mural on the wall, doing window treatments. But for now, this is still the space. And all these toys that is the next to go. It needs to be sorted. A lot of expensive toys there. And then, you can see Mona Lisa still sitting there. I picked up that Mona Lisa actually at the Louvre Museum when I was in Paris. Um, what do you call that? So, that's what I'm doing so far to to just kind of occupy my time and while um because jesse he already saw mama they're doing you know he's got to hold her hand and spend time with her while everybody was there but now everyone actually is has left and the only one that's going to stay tonight because they only allow two people to stay to, to that they can stay over spend the night uh, with Mama and it's Jesse and and Mama's oldest granddaughter Maria. So that's what's happening. Yeah. And uh, she seems to be doing good resting. So hopefully, because she's not breathing on any, she's breathing on her own. So. That's what's great is that she's breathing on her own and, and she gets to probably end up maybe another day or so. Hope so. But you know, again. We don't know. But as I didn't eat last night, uh, and I want to make sure that at least I eat something that's uh, a little bit more filling than air. Uh, I'm having a, a Whopper because Jesse, they were, uh, he didn't eat at all. And so it made me want to eat when I saw them eating. They ordered Whopper Burger King back there. And that's what they were having for dinner, him and Maria. When everybody left the mama's restaurant. So he's just sitting there eating in front of her. And then I was talking with him so that way she can hear his voice. But look. This is a double Whopper. I've done a triple Whopper, actually. Uh, I will order a double Whopper and then have them ask them 
for okay i add on one more patty i only did it once actually once and i can tell you when that was that was the day why it was born and that was oh, no i didn't forget his birthday is october 1st um 2014. i had my first triple whopper because that was the time when i think uh, i first heard of their whopper wednesday so it was a wednesday because it was a uh, it was that was the time i i had the Whop the whopper special so i had two but one of them i had you know extras so here goes mm. normally i eat with onions but they were also eating fries so i'm gonna eat this thing just like i was talking to my sister and brother today and i guess everyone who heard or who, who heard that mama wanted empanada everybody had an empanada today for her so people were buying two and eating one for themselves and one for mama Mm. So that was cute. So I decided I'll do the same thing with the Whopper. Mm. Mm. I think I'm going to need a drink. It's beginning to get messy, but mm. one moment, please. I need to get Daigo. I gotta show you this. Hold on. As I was saying, it's always a, this is a habit. I've done this every time we travel. I always gotta do this and it became a habit. So right out of the airport, Guam's airport, I would order, always order a Burger King to eat there. And then also I take extras to go. And I would also buy extra Daigo's for one of the stands nearby at the airport and I would add my Daigo into it like this place the Daigo into the Whopper oh my god it is it is so good Daigo and, and burgers are really good together even with a Big Mac oh that's how I would eat it mmm mmm Well, sorry, Pete. I had to change because the Daigo bag of Daigo actually slipped <laughs> behind the paper bag, and it spilled on me. And I didn't want uh, I didn't want to get it all. It's on my it was on my thighs and my hair. All that. This is hot, and you know what it's going to do? I'm going to be hot. I had to change. Mm. Anyhow, so like I was saying, oh my god, it's so juicy, it's just too big. But, um, I had extra napkin. Uh, what I normally order is a Whopper Junior, and then I will add, uh, ask for an extra patty, which is $1.50. They add on to that, and with cheese, because you gotta save it with cheese. And then, you know, because it's easier to eat, it's smaller, it tastes, I don't know, the Junior Whopper tastes different, it tastes better than the bigger Whopper. Mm. <coughs> Very saucy that it gets to your throat. And I'm drinking hot. And... Sorry, Utah. Jesse should have brought some hot there. You guys can get your hot. Not at the sink. 
See the sauce. My God. It's like eating a college junior. Mm. Right? The other night, when I had McDonald's, it was, I don't know if I was telling you, it was so fresh. The fries was, just came out of the fryer and so did the burger. Okay. I'm going to eat the part where the guy goes out. I'm sorry to do look. I'm afraid to open it, but I got to. Mmm. Mmm. There it goes. Why are you guys eating? Do you like look for the little ones? Look for the little ones that are salty and crispy and easier to eat. That's when you know when you're done with the fries when all the short ones are gone. And the soft ones. 
Okay. Enjoy your Hanum peeps. You need to have Hanum every day. Stay hydrated, like they say. Anyhow, thank you so much for joining me for lunch. I don't think we're gonna continue with that. I'm done. I'm done. I'm totally done. And thank you, peeps. This is my first dining on your wonderful table. Um, I'm sure you have wonderful meals. I can see all the the great fun you guys had on this on the table. Many celebrations. Many birthday celebrations, breakfasts, and things like that. I'll keep it up. Okay? Holiday peeps. Holiday Guam. Thank you for much, so much for joining me on this short meal. I hope I didn't take up too much of your time, but anyhow. Holiday peeps. I'll see you guys. Adios.